Black Eric D. Nice on YouTube. I call it F-165. If you don't like it, go. All right, two Black here. Listen, I didn't film this because my, ne my niece called me and I started talking to her. But I'm going to tell you how this thing works, right? Yeah, I know it's backwards, but there's a screw here. There's a screw here, and there's a screw way down there. The third screw is down there. It's just the opposite, okay? When you get these screws out, you just grab the light, you know, just grab the light, like here, maybe here. And it seemed like there's another screw, but there's not. There's a thing that sticks right in there. This right here sticks right in there. You work your way out. This washer was right here, okay? Now, make sure you remember which light was blown. I think it was this light here, I think. Um, yeah, I think it was. And I may have asked for the wrong light. I may have because, I don't know, they, they might be the same. But my light is black, I think. Let's, let's go see. Okay. It may not matter. I guess if it's the right plug, it'll plug in. Oh, by the way. This right here. You squeeze it. You might have to work it back and forth. It comes out. And then this door sit like this. And you just squeeze this right here and lift up on this door. And then you turn this. I think I turned it counterclockwise. But you'll figure it out. Either clockwise or counterclockwise. I think I turned it counterclockwise. And to take it out, you do this. Okay, you just, I guess, unplug this right here. GM got to make stuff difficult. Oh, yes. Uh, you might have to get a screwdriver. Okay. That looks like it could be burnt out. All right, now, you know how you have people who say that you have to put, you know, lugs on, you have to torque them and all that kind of stuff? But those same people tell you, don't touch the light bulb. But if you accidentally touch the light bulb, whatever. Well, it bolts in, so. Stick it back in. Okay, I think I turned it counterclockwise to get it to go out. So I'm turning it clockwise to get it to go back in. So now <clears throat> I just plug the light back in. Well, first of all, put this cover back on. And like I said, you just squeeze that right there to unlock it. Plug this back in like that. Okay, this it goes on top of that. And like I said, you want to make sure that washer is in the right place. Can't hold the camera, so I'm gonna switch the camera. Well, first of all, let's check and make sure it works. Now, sound like you put it in gear, the parking brake pops off. <clears throat> so you can't 
The only way to get the lights to come, well, I don't know, the lights might come on with that. Let's see. So, put your parking brake down, cut the car off, cut the car back on, but don't start it up, then put it in drive, your parking brake won't release, but the headlight should be on. I'm sorry, the daytime running lights. And now they're working again. So that's what you gotta do to fix the daytime running lights. The um, headlights work. Actually, those are the, also the headlights. Anyway, let's put the thing back together. Okay, basically, guide that hole in first. Make sure this is on top and that's on top. That washer is still down there. And I'm gonna put the washer in. Oh hell, I dropped it. Okay, that's not gonna hold, so get you some paper towel and put on top. Get you some paper towel like that. Stick it on like that. And voila, see that? All right, get that one started. Th throw away your paper towel. I think all the screws are the same. Now, how am I going to get the ratchet out of here? I cannot reach it. And I don't have my freaking magnet with me. Please don't fall. Don't fall. No. Come on, baby. There you go. There you go. There you go. There you go. Yeah, I got dirty, but hey. I'm be wearing gloves in. I, you know what, guys? I forget to put the damn gloves on. Yep, I forget to put the damn gloves on. Well, guys, I thought the damn screws in. It wasn't in. Man, I'd be God. I gotta figure out a way to push this back. There you go. Alright, now we gotta do the paper trick again. Trick again. Slide the paper on top. This time, make sure the bolt is in. Go away 
bit of paper, wrap your ratchet. Guys, it's going into metal, but it don't need to be torqued in, guys. And that is how you replace the headlight on the 2001 Cadillac DeVille. Hope y'all enjoyed the video.